Welcome to DACOS System, a collaborative project between Ruthenium, Blender for Dental, and Metadac Company. In this video tutorial, we will guide you through the installation of the DACOS plate into your articulator. After purchasing the DACOS module on the Blender for Dental website, you can download the DACOS Master Calibrator STL files. You will find a button directly on the software, and you can choose from three different offsets, tight, standard, and loose. It is recommended to use the standard offset. Once you've chosen the offset that matches your 3D printing system, you'll need to print the calibrators using your current 3D printer and the same model resin that you'll use later for printing your dental models. After downloading the STL file, import it into your 3D slicing software. Make sure to rotate the models so that the caps face the build plate, as shown here. This orientation will match how you'll print your dental models. Once both the upper and lower calibrators are positioned correctly, proceed with automatic support generation. After generating the supports, carefully check that there are no supports on the edge areas. If any supports are present, remove them manually to avoid compromising the stability of the calibrators. After verifying this, proceed with slicing and printing the calibrators. When the 3D printing is complete, You'll notice the calibrators have four pins for positioning the upper and lower parts, and three magnet holders. The holders should not touch each other, and this is correct. As a first step, use the glue jet tool to place the magnets into the four attachments, both upper and lower. After this, you can secure the magnets using adhesive to create a magnetic system, or alternatively, you can fix them temporarily with wax or elastic. Once the master calibrators are ready, you can begin installing the DACOS plate. The DACOS plates are labeled to differentiate the upper and lower plates. You can find the respective upper and lower markings on the back of each plate, ensuring they're not mixed up during installation. If your articulator has a dedicated occlusal plane, you can use the DACOS pilot calibrator included in the intro kit to first fix the upper DACOS plate. Afterward, you'll use the printed master calibrator to install the lower plate. In this tutorial, we'll show you how to install the DACOS plates using elastic bands and an articulator without an occlusal plane plate. Before proceeding with installation of the plates, please make sure your articulator pool is set to zero. To ensure the position is maintained while applying plaster, first temporarily fix the plates following the occlusal plane reference and the Bonwell triangle by applying silicone on the lower DACOS plate. Before applying plaster, use Vaseline to prevent residue from sticking to the DACOS plates. Then mix the plaster and begin securing the upper DACOS plate. Once the plaster has set approximately 30 minutes, remove the temporary silicone and proceed to install the lower DACOS plate. The installation process is now complete and your DACOS system is ready to use for all your cases. 